good morning, good morning, guys. Looks like we got us a really, really bad wreck there to the left. Man, there's like two, three, four wheelers and a semi truck over here. Man, oh man. That looks like a really, really, really bad wreck. Looks like they closed the highway completely. Yep, everybody is coming to a slowdown even on this side. But uh, yeah, anyways, uh, just figured I'd say good morning and show you guys that. We are in Minneapolis right now. And uh, yeah, so let's continue on cruising down the road, guys. I think we're getting closer and closer to be actually making this a little bit of a pit stop. I'm coming up on Alexandria, Minnesota here in about 10 miles. We got a uh, pilot truck stop there. And I think I'm gonna go pull in there and take my half an hour break. Yeah, just, you know, probably make me a sandwich or something like that. Get me a quick bite to eat and then continue on with our journey, right? That's the plan anyways. But yeah, we, uh, I don't know, earlier when I tried to record that uh, accident there in Minneapolis, my remote was acting up or whatever. It, like I, I think, I don't know if I told you guys this before, but I have this remote that I use to record. And so that way I don't have to touch any of my cameras so I can do this wirelessly, basically hands-free, right? And uh, this remote operates both of my cameras at the same time. So I don't have to touch any of my cameras at all. So we always try to do this safely. And uh, for some odd reason it wasn't, uh, wasn't turning both of the cameras on. I wasn't turning on the top one here, so it was only turning on the front one there. But whatever, at least we captured it. We captured that accident out there. Well, we didn't actually capture the actual accident. Accident, but the aftermath of the accident, right? And it looked like a pretty nasty accident up there, but... Anyways, uh, we got a busy, busy day ahead of us. Yep, that's right. And then uh, same thing tomorrow. Tomorrow is not going to be too much of a relaxing day, that's for sure. Got a lot of things to do. Oh well, that's how it goes. Anyhow, let's make our way up here to the uh, pilot truck stop and take our half an hour break. Well guys, I am now coming up to the border here in a mile or so. And uh, we'll be... Uh, back in Canada I love it I love it that means I'll be home in about an hour and an hour and 20 minutes I would say I should be home sweet home I'm really really looking forward to what we got planned here so uh, I'm super super excited 1.5 miles I really am Keep to the left on Lord yep, Highway. so Highway I guess uh, we're gonna start slowing her down because we gotta reduce her speed limit because we gotta cross the border, right? And they are, looks like they are making a new uh, road up here and what I've been hearing is towards the right there, they're building the road towards the right and they're gonna be putting up a truck lane, a better one up there. It's supposed to be several new lanes of truck lanes up there. Which, you know, that would probably be really good. Sometimes we need that. We need the extra lanes up there. And up here you can kind of see that it kind of curves that way. And so you'll be able to have Speed a bunch more lanes up there. I heard, the, what was it, six or eight, eight lanes or something like that is what I've been hearing they're going to be putting up over there. So that would be really nice. But anyhow, we're going to have to get out of here in a minute. We're just about to come up to the booth here. Let's see here. Oh, it almost looks like they're already uh, routing us that way, or is or am I mistaken? Am I mistaken, or is that really happening? It almost looks that way. Yeah, it sure does. It says new lanes open that way. Oh, look at that, guys! I just finished telling you guys that they were planning on opening more lanes up there. And now it sounds like they are open. So yeah, we're gonna have to go that way. You used to just have to go straight and you'd be at the booth, but oh well, we got a couple of trucks ahead of us, so 
We'll go ahead and get out of here guys and uh, we'll see you on the other side. All right guys, we have made it home. So let's take a look on what we're up to. Holy moly, look at this. We are ready for some pizza. At least I think so. We got lots of pizza here. Yeah, everybody's eating. Jessica, yeah. what's your Jesse, story? who's here? Hey. Yeah. You already had lunch? Yeah? So, let's go ahead and have us a good uh, bite to eat before it gets cold, right? All right, guys, supper and everything was done. So now, we're going to go out with a big bang. Yeah. We're going to give you one teaser. We're going to give you a little bit of a teaser. Spoiler alert. And then uh, you guys are gonna have to come back and watch tomorrow's video to find out what we're up to. So let's go ahead and show you guys what we're up to. Hey Jesse, you wanna tell everybody what we're up to? You wanna tell everybody what we're up to? Yeah? You 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 telling them this 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 old spoiler alert? No? No? Alright, alright. Alright, here we go guys. You guys see this over here? Ooh, I wonder what that is all about. We got some luggage ready over here. So, guess what we're up to? We're getting ready to go on a trip. And to find out where we're going, you're gonna have to come back tomorrow and see where we're going. <laughs> Are you guys excited? I am. We're going to be going on a really nice trip. And you guys are going to get to see all kinds of new videos here coming up. And that's what I've been saying all week long. We got some exciting stuff happening. So stick around for tomorrow. And we're out of here. So have a great day, everybody. We'll see you back here tomorrow.